All right, today I want to show you how to make rounded corners on your boxes, on your div containers, on your web pages using a Dreamweaver CS6. Dreamweaver has a, a a quick, simple, and easy function built in to do just this. But before we get into it, just let let you know anything below, as far as Internet Explorer is concerned, anything below Internet Explorer 9 will not be able to see the new radius corners we're about to do. Okay. Internet Explorer 8, 7, 6, so forth, so on. Uh, will not be able to see it. You got to have Internet Explorer 9, or you got to have uh, Google Chrome, you got to have Firefox uh, and Opera. All those can see it, but unfortunately, because of the way the browser, Internet Explorer 8 browser was made, and the ones below it, it's not able to display uh, some elements of HTML5, which is exactly what Dreamweaver uses to do this. So, uh, just to do the quick and easy, first thing we want to do is you, assuming you have your web page made, you have your div tags made, and you have it in your style sheet, you need to find your, get your style sheet, you need to find the div, uh, div style tags here that you're targeting, which this is for me right here. And it's going to pull up your properties box. You want to add a new property. And what you want to do is you want to look for border radius. And after you get border radius, you can click on the edit right here, and you'll notice that right here, same for all is checked. This means all four corners are going to get the same radius. For example, I'm going to put 30 radius, a 30 radius here, 30 pixels. And you'll notice up here, I got it in live view, by the way, designed in live view, so I can see the changes in real time. Uh, if I want to change it to 50, I can do that. And you'll notice it changed again. Now, if I I prefer to have, uh, let's say I want to leave the bottoms uh, with the square. So I'm going to change that to zero. I uncheck, uncheck same for all, change that to zero, bottom square. Now if I just want to have, let's say, one corner with the radius. So there, it's very simple, very quick, very easy to do. Again, you know, the Internet Explorer 8 and below is not going to be able to see it. But that's okay. Uh, for those who do have the uh, latest browsers, you know, you can give them a little bit different look there. And uh, just to show you how this applies to a website I did, this is a tattoo web uh, tattoo website for ta excuse me for a tattoo shop I did here in Pensacola, Florida. Now, for the outside here and up here, and for my buttons and all, I did I delayed all that out in Photoshop so all browsers could see it that way. But when I got to this part, it was kind of like a I don't know an afterthought. I need radiuses. Did didn't really feel like creating creating it as an image so I thought I'd just do it quick and easy way but if you'll notice here uh, I believe I put about 35 pixel radius on this box where I have displayed some of their sample tattoos that they did that they uh that they do so again uh, that's just a quick and easy way to do it uh, I'm gonna say probably the vast majority of the browsers will be able to see it as a Internet Explorer 8 is quite old, people's been upgrading and stuff. So, have fun, enjoy. Hope this has helped someone. Have a good day.